Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this quick tutorial, I am going to show you how you can create shared topology in Space Claim. In my previous videos, I have shown you how you can create conformal or non-conformal mesh using shared topology or non-shared topology. And I also did, did simulation for that and you can check that on my channel. In this video, I want to show you there are two ways to create shared topology. Here is the geometry. On the outside, we have this wall. Let me hide this one. And it has uh, three cylinders which are cut from the center. And we want to create this shared topology for this bodies. For that, you can go to the workbench. Here, you can find this option, share. Uh, first, uh, show all those bodies and then create on this button, share. It will show you all these red regions where it has detected the shear faces. If you don't want to create the shear topology on a particular region, for example, let's say we don't want to create shear topology between this wall and this cylinder. Click on this icon and you can unselect this surface. You can see it has been unselected. Similarly, you can unselect this one and uh, then you can also unselect this one. Now, uh, it will create shared topology only between these cylinder and you can hit enter. Then hide this uh, wall from here. Here you can see the shared topology has been created and you can see different color for this interface. If you want to unshare, so you have already noticed there is the option for unshare and you can select whichever you want to unshare. It did unshare over here and from here. You don't need to press anything because it has already ensured and I can unselect. The other option is uh, from direct uh, your geometry tree. For example, I want to create this uh, shear topology between the cylinder. So select, select this component and here in the properties you can see shear topology and here is none. From drop down you can select shear. This body has now shared topology but uh, this wall it is not shared because we have selected this one if we want to create shared topology for all of the component then we have to select the highest level of the geometry you can create shared topology from here now it has created shared topology for all those bodies the only difference here you cannot see shared topology with the different color which you can see from here you have to do only one way, both work in the same way. I prefer from here uh, because I, then I can see where my body has shared topology and where it hasn't. Uh, let me do it again. It doesn't make sense to do it in both ways, but uh, I am doing that just to show you. That's how you can see the different color for this shared topology. That's it for today. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.